folks, Sunday message from the Cathars. Our Divine Mother says in her revelation, My dear children, be awakened. I want to awaken you, not because I am some teacher or your mentor, but I want to warn you, you are in big danger. Do not be deceived by your peaceful everyday life, because many of us don't have a direct threat of war or any other disaster. We have food, we have a roof, we have our work. But this is exactly what she warns against, not to fall into a state of complacency because the disasters will come suddenly, she says. And she wants us to know that her protection is unconditional. Her shield is for those who are dedicated to her, who love her, who are faithful, who are sick, persecuted, lonely. And she wants, to Im wants us to imprint this, these words into our hearts. And she says to remember them in the hours of the disasters. Who is our Divine Mother? Let us be clear. She's not some distant goddess that sits on a cloud. She's the living mother, dynamic. Uh, she's most of all mother, and this word contains everything that, that she is. It's her main quality. What does a mother do when she sees that her children are suffering, are sick, are in danger? She wants to defend them. And we need to know as humanity that there is someone of the highest authority who can defend us and who will defend us. But there are conditions when even such high authority cannot do anything because we are not awakened. Be awakened. Awakened to what? Many people are, think they are awakened and they know what's going on in the world. And we do through the media know about these disasters. We are aware of many secrets. We are awakened to the bad things in the world. But what does it mean? What else does it mean to be awakened? The positive part of being awakened is to know that there is someone who can save the world. But we get, need to get to know her we need to accept her as guide. We need to listen to her word because otherwise she cannot help us. She cannot help, she cannot speak into deaf ears uh, her wisdom, her guidance. We need to learn to listen and know in our hearts that she's the only one our Divine Mother is the only one who can help humanity, who stands on the edge of the abyss. And this is our, our message of today. Be uh, awake to this knowledge, this positive knowledge that we are not orphans, we have a mother who will save us rise to the state of communicating with her. Put your trust in your Heavenly Mother so that she can help and so that you are protected in any circumstance that could happen. We can see this in the Ukraine. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, good people uh, start suffering because 
missiles and terrible bombs fall on their heads. They are burned alive and they don't understand what happened and why. And this, these disasters can happen to all of us, all of humanity in these times. So we wish for you to receive a sign, a direct sign of the presence of our mother in your lives, in your, uh, in your hearts, that you may know she is there for us. <laughs>